Samsung is bringing some good news with the Galaxy S23 series. The devices that are expected to launch in February will not feature a flashy design, but Samsung is making all the right moves to improve the user experience. The upcoming high-end Galaxy phones are expected to bring improved performance, better heat management, higher storage for the base version, improved cameras, and improved battery life. However, the phones won't bring higher RAM. The highest-end version of the Galaxy S23 Ultra has appeared in Geekbench database, confirming that it will feature 12GB RAM. The device, powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 chipset, appears to be running Android 13. It scored 1,495 points in the single-core CPU performance test and 4,647 points in the multi-core CPU performance test. Going by the phone's multi-core score, it has scored lower than other Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 equipped phones. However, in other instances, the phone scored similarly to other Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 phone like the Vivo X90 Pro Plus. The Galaxy S23 series is reportedly bringing a brighter display across the board, even to the base Galaxy S23. The devices in the lineup are also rumored to get an improved cooling solution that could lead to better performance under sustained load. Samsung has reportedly opted to use a higher binned version of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 with up to 3.36 GHz clock speed for its prime CPU core. In the past, Samsung phones with Exynos chips haven't performed as well as their Snapdragon counterparts. In 2022, Samsung shipped more Snapdragon versions of the Galaxy S22 worldwide, but even the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 faced overheating and throttling issues, leading to performance problems under sustained load. Hopefully, the Galaxy S23 series will perform well as the chipset has showcased incredible performance in non-Samsung phones. Let's see what happened in the future. That's it for today. Now, what's your thoughts on this? Comment down below. Peace out.